Hi everyone, this is XM topic covered in 3 minutes. Here we are discussing about karyotyping. So karyotyping is, it is a conventional cytogenetic technique. Then what is the stain that we use? It is a GM cell staining and the bands that we can get in the chromosome is dark and light bands. It is always remember they are reproducible dark and light bands. So this is the image of a conventional karyotyping where you can see dark and white bands. Then a uh, question that can that was asked in one of the exams, which is the banding technique used for a dicentric chromosome. So, which are the different stains and different techniques that we can uh, use under this uh, karyotyping? So, the banding technique number one is the conventional GMs are staining where we are getting the reproducible dark and light bands. Then cunacrin is like it is similar to GMs where we are getting dark and white bands, but the observe we are observing it not under light microscope we are observing it under UV fluorescence microscope. Then another is reverse banding. Reverse banding means we denature the chromosome and whatever is dark in the conventional or GM sustain will be white here and white in the GM sustain will be dark here. So that is called as reverse banding. Next is centromeric banding where specifically the heterochromatin regions are stained. So in a case of dicentric chromosome we will be using C banding. So G banding, Q banding, R banding and C banding. And the next question that was asked is arrange the steps of karyotyping in the correct order. So the first thing is that we have to collect the venous blood. Then what we have to do is we have to culture. So for that we are adding phytohemagglutinin and we are culturing the cells because for karyotyping a growing cell is required. Then what you can see is we are arresting the growth at around three days where you can see we are arresting the growth usually at the metaphase and what is the agent that we use we use colchicin then what we do is we are using a uh, uh, GM sustain and we are looking it under microscope. So these are the technique or these are the uh, steps of karyotyping. So these are the important points that you have to dis uh, learn under the topic of discussion uh, karyotyping. Okay, so stay blessed, stay happy and follow for more. Bye-bye.